Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. So today I'm going to be showing you guys a bunch of spring, early spring type outfits that you can start incorporating into your wardrobe. I'm super excited. I have a bunch of really cool brands to show you and I love just like the pastel colors of spring. It just gets me so excited for just sunshine and fresh flowers and picnics and all the fun things. So I wanted to do a try on video for you guys. So here we go. Okay, so the first thing I have is this Auguste the Label dress. It is stunning. I love it so much. It has a beautiful cut in the neckline and you can also wear it off the shoulder like if you wanted to, but I like it up just for a little bit more support. Um, and then it's pretty, pretty short, but I'm 5'9 for reference. So I have a size Australian eight. So Oz eight, which ends up being, I think like a four, a two or a four. I think it's a four cause it's a little bit, it's not too tight up here. It's pretty, pretty loose, but it's like the perfect little spring picnic dress. It's this little set from Nasty Gal. I am obsessed with it. It's so comfy. It comes with these little shorts. This one is in a size medium. They were sold out of the small, but I have it also in the mauve color in small, and I like the size small better. It just fits me better. This one's a little bit baggy, and the shorts are a little loose, but I still love it. I think it's super cute. You can wear it tucked in. You can wear it kind of off the shoulder with a little bralette. Um, you could just wear it by itself, like the shorts alone with like a little tank or this little sweater with some jeans if it's a little bit cooler. Um, but yeah, it's super fuzzy. I seriously love the texture, it's super comfortable. So nasty gal. Next is this set from Nasty Gal as well. It's just this like sage green color with some white color blocking. It's shorts with a little crop top. I think it's so cute. I think it'd be super cute with just some like white tennis shoes or um, like your hair back in like a little bun. Just kind of like brunch, day out, that sort of thing. I believe I got a size check I got a size small so I love it you can wear it kind of off the shoulder again or or not but yeah so it's just a sage green color this little San Francisco graphic tee says San Francisco California I got this vintage so I can't link this one but there are so many good brands like Urban Outfitters Verge Girl free people that sells like graphic tees like this. So I just really, really love this one. It gives me like spring, summer Miami vibes. Um, and then I have these nasty gal jeans, which are pretty baggy. At the bottoms, they have this little slit, which I'm sure you've seen people wear them with little, they wear them with like little kitten heels, which is totally what I would style it with. Just like a nice little kitten heel. So I'm gonna wear those. And then I'd probably style this with, let's see, probably like these little earrings, which I got from Urban Outfitters. So some little earrings, that would be kind of fun. Or if you wanted to make it super chill, you could wear it with like a little bucket hat or something like that with like a little kitten heel. So this is totally something that I would wear, probably like out to get coffee or running errands or just somewhere where I wanted to be like comfortable and chill. And if you guys follow me on Instagram, you know that I literally live in jeans and oversized t-shirts. So this is totally one of my looks. Next is this oversized kind of distressed t-shirt that I got from Free People. I'm just pairing it with the jeans from Nasty Gal. Um, I don't know if I said this, but I believe I got a size four. So I'm typically a size 26, so I probably would have went down a size. Um, but I like these because they're just that baggy mom fit. Um, but I would probably go down a size. I think this was a little bit too big just because there's a lot of like room, but oversized 
t-shirt with jeans is just like totally a vibe you can just throw it on be super comfortable i'd probably style this with some white vans these i got from free people they're just white platform vans so i would throw this on and then i'd probably do like a little crossbody bag just to make it like super casual and then i'd style it with some little gold hoops, which I have these on right now from Amazon. These are from Urban Outfitters, so you could just do a little gold hoop, some bands, and a little side bag. This guy is actually a vintage Gucci bag, so recent score, so very excited about it. Um, yeah, so you could do it like this, or you could just go here, or what I've been kind of doing is I've been doubling up and wearing it like this, just cause this is a vibe right now. And I feel like you could just totally make this work instead of spending like an extra $800 to get like the little bags that are trendy right now. Just take one of your bags that you already have and rock it like this. So yeah, so I feel like this is a really good look just for going out to shop or I don't know. I love it. I think it's cute. Okay, I wanted to talk about another way that I'd probably style like a t-shirt and jeans just to like vamp it up a little bit would be a denim jacket. So I recently got this at a vintage store. It's just a really light washed Levi's denim jacket. It's pretty oversized, but I would just throw this on with Throw this on with just like a baggy t-shirt. Um, if this is like too much going on, you could always put your hair back in like a slick tight bun with some hoops and kind of dress it up a little bit. Or you could go super casual, um, bring the hat back, just kind of throw on a hat with it. You know, just, it's like, I look cute, but I didn't try too hard. That's totally the vibe that I go for. I have these white, trousers that I got from Brandy Melville. They're super stretchy linen material. I love them. I think they're still available on the website, so I'll link those below. But yeah, I got these from Brandy Melville. And then this guy, I actually thrifted from a little vintage store down in Nashville. You can find these at vintage stores all the time. I have so many of them. Um, but this one just gives me like Italian summer vibes. Um, I would pair this with a little kitten heel. I feel like that would just be so cute and simple. So I do a kitten heel and then I'd probably rock like a little gold chain necklace. This one is a Louis Vuitton padlock necklace that I actually bought vintage as well. It was a pretty penny but I love it I wear it all the time so yeah I would just do like some gold jewelry with it and kind of like a Italian summer lunch you could even wear this for dinner I think but I love the white it's very springy fresh I have this little white linen blouse from the brand bird and kite I'm wearing a size small and I just paired it with the same trousers from Brandy Melville. You could tuck this in or just like let it be flowy. Um, I would again pair this with some dainty little gold jewelry. And then if I wanted to like spice it up, I would say I'd probably wear this with some flip flops for a casual like beachy look. Or I would wear just like some white tennis shoes to make it more like I don't know, like on the go, kind of like less girly because this top can go girly really quick and it's not totally my style. So I'd probably like throw on some tennis shoes with it just to kind of like balance it out a bit. But I think it'd be super cute to incorporate like a little scarf. I love these things for spring because you could wear it around your neck just like as a little scarf. Um, you could wear it up in your hair if you're like going to a beach or something you could also my favorite way to wear it is if you have a thick enough one which 
This one's thick enough, I think. You can wear it around your waist, which obviously I wouldn't wear it with this top, but so yeah, you could make it like a little tube top if you wanted, which is super fun. Um, I've totally worn this around like a tube top before multiple times. So that's always fun. Or you could even like have it be like a little belt or something. So these are really, really fun to have. Just play around with it in spring as like an accessory. But personally, I would probably just wear this with some tennis shoes and my hair down and kind of make it like a chill all white vibe. I think another thing that you could always do is add a hat. This one is from Olive and Peak. It's just like a little rancher hat, straw. It's like a mauve color. But I think this would also be super cute just if you wanted to go for that like European, like Australian all white vibe. So this is what I was talking about with the scarf, just kind of like tying it up and making a little bra top out of it. I think it's really cute. It's more of like a summer vibe, but you could always throw on like a little jacket with it um, and make it like a night out look or like a denim jacket, denim on denim and just make it like a cool street style look. But yeah, I love these things. I actually got this one at Goodwill. So yeah, you can totally find these everywhere. I have so many of them um, and I thrifted all of them. They're usually like a dollar or two dollars. So yeah. Another way you could wear it is just by tucking these little pieces into the shirt. So you could just kind of tuck them in and it looks like a little swimsuit top. Yeah, so I really like this look. Um, I'm gonna pair this as a bralette underneath the overalls in the next slide, so. Okay, and then last but not least are these overalls that I thrifted. I'm obsessed with them. I got them in California on my last trip. And I just paired them with that scarf that I showed you. I just tied it up like a little bralette, but you could totally wear like a bralette or a t-shirt or something like that under these. I would totally pair these with some Vans or some tennis shoes and just make it super chill. And then I'd probably like wear, you could wear a little bucket hat for just like a total Instagram vibe. Or if you didn't want to make it like that, I would put my hair up in a bun. I feel like sometimes when there's just a lot going on in the outfit, you just want your hair to be like sleek back and out of your face. So I would do like a little bun and then like some fun earrings or something. So yeah, that's totally like a cute little spring look. It's like denim, but you could just wear a little bralette and kind of like let your arms get some sunshine. <laughs> yeah, so. So well, this is the final look. Thank you guys so much for watching. I am super excited for spring and I'm excited to do another one for summer, which is just around the corner. So let me know if you guys like this type of video. Um, a lot of this stuff is brands that I've actually worked with. So if you guys wanna see more, I could do like try on hauls. I'd love to do that. I work on Instagram. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, Go over there and follow me. It's at Taylor Nicole Hayden. You can see all of these looks I've already posted in like half of these already. So like and subscribe if you're new. I'd love to have you. And let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. So yeah, happy spring.